What's going on, everybody? It's Ace Turn and Ninja here today, my dudes, for a brand new episode of a Pokemon Diamond randomized type like. Hopefully, you guys are excited for today's episode. If you are, make sure you drop that like for me down below. It really does help out a whole smeckles of a lot, okay? Smeckles? That's not a word, as far as I know, but it, it is now. It helps out a whole schmeckles of a lot, okay? Subscribe if you're new around here and share this video with a friend. But let's do. A quick team recap real fast. First off, we have Metro, the Torque Tick at level 26. With the amulet coin, modest nature, serene grace, ability, Ragnarok's full sword, metronome, power gem, and yawn. 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 Next up, we have Dario, the him on top of level 27, with the shell, bell, rash nature, intimidate ability, rock the moves, triple kick, rock smash, quick attack. In rapid spin. Next up, we have Asteroid Lapras, level 24, with the Mystic Water, Gentle Nature, Water Absorb, Ability, Rock of the Moves, Water Pulse, Ice Shard, Body Slam, and Rain Dance. Next up, we have Bad Words, Deceptile, level 23, with the, <laughs> with the, with the Meadow Plate, Rock in the Moves, wait, Rock in the Moves, Bold Nature, okay, no. <clears throat> Bold Nature, Overgrow Ability, Rock of the Moves, Absorb, X is your Pursuit. And quick attack. Next up, we have Great Wall, the Bastion, level 24 with the leftovers. Brave Nature, starting ability, rock the moves, take down, iron defense, taunt, and protect. And last but not least, we have Egg. A mysterious Pokemon egg received from Traveling Man. The Egg Watch, quote unquote. What will hatch from it? It doesn't seem to be close to hatching. Okay. Well, sick, bro. Glad it's not close to hatching, because we wouldn't want any kind of new team members anytime soon. Nope, not us. Never we. Okay. Moving along. So, we did already get an encounter on this next route. Oh, by the way, I did, um, I did do a little bit of, uh, a little bit of off-screen stuff. Nothing, nothing crazy cool. But I got a bunch of Moo Moo Milk, so now we have that. So that's nice. Also, we have one rare candy, so we might just, uh, we might just give someone a, a quick boost, <laughs> just for lols. Uh, let's see who actually can like get the most out of it though. Looks like Bastiodon, honestly. Looks like Bastiodon, honestly. We'll give him the we'll give him the right candy real fast. Level 25 is better than level 24, right? Plus he's one level closer to getting like a, a move that we can use. I'm pretty sure he gets a uh, what engine power at like level 28 or 32 or something like that. It's two very different levels, but you know it's one of those two. Also. Uh, my game seems to be running worse than normal today. I don't know why. I didn't do anything, but uh, <laughs> yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> uh, I'm really glad that that's happening. So just, just hang in there. Stick with me, guys. Apologies. Technician Veronica with the Moltres out here in the rain. Clearly, he doesn't know what Weather Wars is. Of course, this is pre-Gen 5, so Weather Wars wasn't really a thing yet, but he doesn't know what it is nonetheless. Honestly, honestly, man, you're trash. I get a good. Uh, okay, we're gonna go to asteroid because I resist the fire. Uh, actually, or am I neutral fire? I guess I'm neutral fire uh, and resist the flying. So it's weird that this big old bulky water type is taking neutral damage from a fire move. But I guess that's what happens when you have combating typings. One typing resists, one typing is super effective against, or super effective from, takes super effective damage. Blah, 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 blah. So I got told. Okay, we're gonna talk real fast. I'm gonna give a little, little, short little, uh, one on one conversation. Okay. Um, I got told yesterday that, uh, and I don't, I don't wanna, by any means, to call this person out. It's just a topic of conversation I wanna talk about for a second. Um, I'm not trying to call anyone out. Like you know, I, I, I respect this guy. Uh, he he was being very honest with me when he told me this, and that's fine. And I appreciate that. I'm just I just want to talk about it for a second, okay? Now that's out of the way. Um, I, I'm not gonna name who it is, but uh, if you know who you are, and you're watching this video, uh, just just know I'm not trying to talk trash on you or anything. I'm just just want to talk about it. You know, just want to get opinions from people. Anyway, um. I got told the other day that Let's Plays are dead. Now, I know, and you people watching this know, that that's just not true. It's just, just simply not true. Um, but I got told the other day that Let's Plays are dead. 
probably the same way Fortnite's dead. Um, and, and that if I wanted to grow my channel and wanted to get more uh, interaction on my videos, more views or whatever, that I needed to stop doing Let's Plays and start posting like top five videos or conspiracy videos or theory videos or whatever. Um, and you know, I, I as nicely as possible told him, you know, you know, I'm not doing this for the views. Uh, even though more views would be fantastic, and sometimes I do worry about it a little bit. Um, with I worry about views a little bit with how with the subscriber count compared to the view count gets me gets me sometimes. But you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. Now there's nothing I can really do about that. I try my best. I do the I, pro I produce the best content that I possibly can with the just with what I have to work with. Um, you know, I do I do everything I can, but um, yeah, he, he pretty much said that you know there's no way that my channel is gonna do anything better than what it is right now if I don't start doing other stuff, uh, which is fair in a sense, but I don't think it's fair to say as a general statement. Also, I realized that as I was talking about this and talking to the face cam, worrying about that, I almost just lost bad words. I realized this. Apologies. We're gonna. <laughs> We're gonna get back on topic for just a second here, and uh, hmm, let's swap out. Let's swap out here. Let's uh, let's do something, do something different. We literally can't attack you with this guy, so we're gonna go into asteroid once again. Okay, back to our back to our one on one conversation here. Um, yeah, I wanted. I pretty much, pretty much just wanted to say, or and ask really, um, what your opinion on that is. Like, do you think that as a growing, slow growing, let's play channel, um. I should just stick with it and try to grow a community around my let's plays and see if anything comes from that or or if I should just throw my controller on the ground call it a day and start you know selling out by the way I actually just threw my controller on the ground and I didn't mean to but um it worked so well <laughs> it, <laughs> I, I honestly did not mean to throw my controller on the ground I just dropped it anyway um yeah should, should I just like just give up let's plays and just go on I can do like daily streams or semi-daily streams. I don't even get daily videos up, but like semi-daily streams or like um, focus on like Twitch or something. Like I don't know. Like is there something like that that you guys feel would be better for me as a content creator to do? Um, I don't know. I feel very at home with Let's Plays. I feel very very comfortable with a let's play um, like this kind of video right here like I can just sit down and talk to you guys one-on-one -on -one conversation uh, of course you guys aren't can't reply to me right now because you know that's honestly if I want to replies I'd go straight for the uh, chat of a, of a live stream but like <laughs> still like I feel like I can sit here and talk to you guys about this um, even though you guys can't hear me until like a day later when the video goes up and your replies would be in the comment section and eventually I'll read them um, I just almost threw Asteroid away. I want us to realize that I'm totally throwing this Let's Play right now trying to talk about this. <laughs> yeah, I just want to get you guys' opinion, okay? Go to the comment section, let me know what you guys think. Uh, if you guys think there's anything better that I should be focusing on more, uh, anything best best for me as a content creator that you guys think I should, I should, I should go more for. Um, honestly, at the end of the day, you know, it's, it's my, it's my channel. I can do with it what I want, right? But, um, I just want to know if anybody has any suggestions, anybody has any thoughts, ideas, whatever, what have you, you know. That's all. That's all I was going for. So yeah, thanks for listening. I'm going to shut up now. We're going to go back into the gameplay. That was a full, that was a full 10 minutes of the episode since spent rambling on that. Might be ominous wind. Okay. This guy's trying to go for the boots. Again, the critical hits left and right. <gasps> My guy. Okay, you, you did about, you did 20 with a crit. So we should be fine to go for a water pulse here. We outspeed you anyway. Okay. <laughs> Golly, Spear Tim, you are being annoying. You are being a pain in my batukas. That's for sure. Technician Veronica, get out of here, girl. You're not good. Good, good scrubber. Okay, we're going to go back and heal, though. Because he, <laughs> honestly, he did some work. Honestly, he did some work. This is Trisha Takanawa saying honestly, he done some work. That was not a good accent, but you get the idea. By the way, my game's so framey. It's grossing me out, dude. Like, I want to shut down the game and just open it back up and see if it does anything. I don't think it will, but I want to try that. I want to give that a go. 
I set highest priority possible to the emulator and secondary priorities to OBS because OBS doesn't seem to be lagging at all with recording right now. So, um, secondary priorities to OBS, main full focus priorities on the game and it's still lagging. Now, if I, if I play the game without OBS open or without OBS recording, um, then it runs beautifully. It runs runs like it was a regular DS. You know, it's fantastical, but it does not work if I have OBS open. I don't know why, and it bugs me, and I wish it didn't do that, but that's what happens. So, also, I've I figured out that the way that most people do their YouTube setups and recording setups, streaming setups, and all that kind of stuff is they have one computer for the gameplay and a second computer for recording, streaming, whatever, so that each computer can focus, focus on its individual task instead of having one computer doing everything, uh, which honestly makes so much sense. I don't know why I didn't realize that earlier, but yeah. So I'm going to try to get a capture card so I can stream slash record from my second computer and then transfer the files back to this one from, from, from editing, or get a secondary beast computer that I build on my own or whatever and have one computer. Um, I have this computer I'm using right now for streaming slash recording and then the other one for uh, the gameplay and stuff. So that's my goals. That's my YouTube goals. If you guys want to help contribute to the YouTube goals for better content all around, streams, recordings, all of it would be better content. If you guys want to help contribute, you guys can go down to the com or down to the, um, the description and check out my Patreon page where you guys can, you know, do Patreon things. I don't ever remember to keep up with the rewards and stuff though, so just fair warning. <laughs> You'd really be doing it out of the kindness of your heart. You're not going to get much from me. Uh, I never pay attention to the rewards and stuff on Patreon. Because nobody ever does anything on Patreon. Nobody donates to the streams. Nobody does anything like that. You know, I'm doing this all for free out of the kindness of my heart. And because I enjoy doing it and you guys enjoy watching it and it makes me feel good inside. Team 66! City 6? Alright, what you got for me? 66, 66, 66, 66, TM 66 is going to be Shadow Ball. Interesting. I'm pretty sure she's usually like Return or something. Oh, never mind, it's not Return. Definitely not Return because nobody could learn it. What is it normally? Bulk up? Maybe? Are there... The weather is making the game lag right now, by the way. My weather in game is making the game laggy. Love it. Gotta love it, man. Gotta love. Gotta love it. Yeah, you guys should definitely go and send me money so I can build a better computer and a second computer so that I can have good content for you guys to enjoy. It starts raining. Now, guess what? It's snowing <laughs> at the same time. Because Pokemon. x -Sister, how much is this doing? It's super effective. Coming off a solid, but not fantastic base attack. Didn't do as much as I was hoping, perfectly honest. Didn't do nearly as much as I was hoping. By the way, does, is it just me or is it bum snow intimidating? Like, if you walked up on this boy in the middle of the night in a dark alleyway, and you saw nothing but those glowing purple eyes at you, you might just have a heart attack and run the other way. I'm just saying, like, I would. I'd pee my pants. Look at those, look at those menacing eyeballs. How much is this doing, by the way? More than I like. Look at those menacing eyeballs, dude. Look at him. Look at him dead in the eye and tell me that you would not poop yourself and run the other way. You can't. You can't do it. You just can't do it. Plus, he's got the spikes on his back. Plus, there's a mega evolution. Dude, imagine if this boy walked up on you, like, menacingly slowly walking out of the shadows and then just like boom mega evolves right in your freaking face okay yeah, okay i'm giving myself nightmares now <laughs> um i'm gonna be honest dude i wasn't sure about recording today i've had a pretty slow day i've been pretty pretty bummy not gonna lie i've been chilling waiting for the comcast guys to show up that ended up canceling our appointment without telling us so i was sitting around for two hours waiting for them to show up and then my grandmother goes to check with them at their uh the local store, local shop, whatever. Uh, she goes and talks to them, and she calls me. And she's like, "Yeah, they canceled. They canceled our uh, our meeting without telling us." So, yeah, good news. You just spent a good three hours of your day waiting for someone who wasn't coming. This bump, yeah, it was awesome. Um, why does Asteroid keep going to sleep, dude? Are you tired? Do you need a nap? Get some coffee. 
Get some coffee, 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 coffee. <gasps> Swagger souls, huh? Let's break out of the confusion before we wake up. Let's break out of the confusion before we wake up, please. I came shrouded in mist. In mystery and wonder. We're gonna wake up and then punch ourselves in the face. Aren't we? I foresee that. 100%. That's our future. We're gonna wake up and punch ourselves in the face for big damage. Mm, well, it wasn't big damage. It wasn't really that big a damage. I can, I'll, I'll give you that. At least it wasn't big damage. Okay, we're confused. Sick, bruh! We have to break out confusion like this turn. Or just hit him. Why was that so hard? We're having so much trouble with all our battles today, dude. So much trouble with all of our battles today, dude. It's honestly a little bit disturbing. Well, I don't really know what we're gonna be doing about this today. I think we should go ahead and just go back to the Pokemon Center and heal up real fast, but uh, the, uh, the, the, the YouTuber in me and thinks that we should just continue on, keep on trucking, trying to get to the next area. I don't know why I'm talking with such a nasally voice right now, but I think it kind of works for the character that I'm going for. I don't really know what the character is, but I think, I think he works at like a news station or something. I think he's like a little, a little on the camera sometimes. Yeah, I think he's just a little bit of news, a little bit of newspaper writing maybe. I don't know. He's probably a journalist. As if I'm, you know, I think it's what I'm going for is a little bit of a journalist, like a nasally know-it-all journalist type of thing. You know, but so someone who talks for like ten minutes on camera and then finally gets to the point. I don't really know what he's going for, but <laughs> I don't know what I'm going for. <laughs> Uh, uh, can we just go ahead and get a hashtag best episode ever in the comment section down below? How many times have you laughed out loud already? I know I'm laughing at myself. I don't know if you guys are laughing at me, but I'm laughing at me. Also, Mr. Mime looks like a pedo, not gonna lie. Uh, and by the way, for those of you kids out there who doesn't, who don't know what a pedo is, he's a man who likes to distribute ice cream. You should talk to your parents about more. Um, ask them, ask them about these things. You need to know, trust me. Uh, if you already know, then awesome, good for you. Don't tell anyone. Or don't tell anyone on the video. Don't don't comment anything about it. Okay, we're, you know what? We're gonna move on. Cause I don't know what I'm doing. By the way, can we get one more quick attack in and just take care of this Mr. Mime? Mr. Mime. Mr. Mime. Moving along. Moving along. Level 28, too. We're getting, we're getting a little bit of high levels here. We got a counter. Hmm. Counter may honestly be more useful than rapid spin. Potentially, if we're in a tight situation, there is the potential for counter to be more useful. We got Kingdra coming in here. What can we do against Kingdra, though? Not much. Not much. I'm going to Asteroid real fast. I'm going to go... For some sick plays, okay? We're gonna get grappler play with the deagle right in the face, okay? That's what we're going for right here. We're going for the grapple grapple deagle. This is what we're doing for right now. I don't, I don't know, I have no idea what I'm talking about. Like 19% of the time, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. How many more? Oh, you're gonna swap out into your steam like so. Well, guess what? I do have a super effective rain boosted move just for you. My guy, plus your light screen just wore off. So get friggin' erect. Sometimes I just feel like I need to shut up. <laughs> Honestly, just sometimes I feel like I need to just shut my gosh diggity gosh darn mouth. Ew, I went for the water pulse. Didn't mean to do that. It's rain boosted. I'm just doing nothing. Literally not a sick bro. Alright, let's go for the body slam again. It's not enough, but he healed my HP, so that's nice. That was real nice of him. I appreciate that. You're a good friend, Kingdra. You are a good friend. Swimmer Donna. Swimmer Donna has been defeated. Alright, I kind of want to get this item up here in the corner, but I'm, I know we're going to encounter like 14 wild Pokemon. I know we are. Hello, Seal. I'm going to run away from him, dude. I'm not even going to like waste time. 
Because Dario doesn't need the experience. Plus, we can come back and train. We can do a grinding montage if we have to before the next gym. There's no item back here? I've been bamboozled. I could have sworn to you that there was an item up there. I could have sworn on my mother's truck. I was gonna say my mother's grave, but she's not dead, so it doesn't really mean anything. Um, I could have sworn there was an item up there, dude. Do I have cut? No, we don't have cut right now either. Sick, bro. We're super prepared. <laughs> We're super prepared. All right, scoop this boy up. It's a wave incense. <clears throat> interesting, interesting. Uh, I'm probably gonna like just like do a quick run through of the game at some point, and um, I'll run back through the game at some point with a cut mon. I just get all those cut bush items, cause it's gonna bug me knowing that I didn't get them. It will. It'll drive me a little bit bonkers. Quick double battle for your viewing pleasure. I'll battle anyone. I was about to read something that wasn't there. I'll battle anyone. That's how I'll get better. Ooh. Ooh. I'm taking the Veilstorm Gym Challenge, but first, let me slap you up real fast. Oh. By the way, it's 2v1, and watch you guys get schooled. Schoolboy Malcolm and Mark. <gasps> I'm gonna school you both. What are you doing hopping in here with these two Gen 2 normal types? What are you doing? What are you doing, man? You're living the wrong life. Get on the Gen 4 train, please. I can't say that. I have a Gen 1 and a Gen 2 mon. Or Gen 1 and Gen 3 mon. Currently on my on my side of the field. It will. And yes, it went for the Water Pulse instead of the super effective Ice type move. Because I thought with the Rain boost, it should still be enough to take out the Hoot Hoot. I could be wrong. But if I am wrong, it's okay. Because it's not going to be that big of a deal. It's just a hoot hoot. It might put someone to sleep. That'd be the most annoying thing it could possibly do. It's fine. Ooh, it's just barely not enough. Goes for the confusion. And he doesn't even get the confused hacks, dude. You're not good, scrub. You're not good. Get on my level. Smeargle. You're gonna trace a water pulse or a rock smash? Which one are you going for here? I'm just gonna take out this thing. Just so this is, you know, a guaranteed no chance of doing anything shenanigany. We don't want any of that. How much is rock smash doing to this thing? <gasps> Enough. You have two, you had two normal types. You had two normal types. Don't you normally have like an Abra and a Kadabra? And I don't know what this other guy has. I think it, oh wait, I think he started with a Monferno. I think it was a Monferno and a Kadabra. And then followed up with a, a Monferno and an Abra. And then followed up with a Gyarados. Okay, calm down. <laughs> okay, chill out. It's not that serious. Uh, we'll go for the Water Pulse here. And getting, we're getting Dario out of here. I'm not trying to take a stab, super effective confusion from a legendary. Not happening. Okay, we see the future site instead. Interesting, interesting. He's going for the long game. I, I get it, I get it. You're trying to get strats going on here. Well, the sad thing is, I don't know if you have enough time to get these strats going on. Because you see, you just got confused hacks by, by my water pulse. By my water pulse. By my Lapras, who is also a Gen 1 1, by the way. So we got Gen 1 versus Gen 1, Illuminati confirmed. I'm gonna go for another water pulse right here on this confused Mew 2, who's gonna hurt himself in confusion. So water pulse plus, plus a takedown from Grey Wall should be, should be enough to take this thing down right here, right now. But that's the theory. A game. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I, honestly, I watched two Game Theory episodes today. I don't know why. I watched one on Super Hot, uh, and then one on um, Spider-Man, the new Spider-Man game. I don't know why. They were just like, they popped up on my, on my feed, and I was like, you know, I've heard a lot of things about the Game Theory channel, and I have never actually watched a Game Theory video. Let's check this out. Let's do the thing. 
Let's get a little bit connected with our younger viewing audience. Look, I'm a kid. <laughs> Look at me, I'm a child. Wikiberry. <laughs> Look at me, I'm a kid. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. You know, honestly, hashtag best commentary ever. Of anyone. And anywhere on YouTube. Best commentary ever anywhere on YouTube, man. This is the best Pokemon video you will ever see. My commentary is all over the weird places, dude. All over the weird places. Where's the where's the Pokemon Center? We need to find the Pokemon Center. We need heals right now, please, and thank you. Hello, bald man. How you doing? You're looking like a darn cue ball, man. You're looking like a precious cute precious little cue ball. Yeah, so fucking precious when you're bald. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, dude. I love it, though. I love it, though, dude. Honestly, I feel like I'm going to watch back this episode and be like, yo, what the fuck was I doing? Dude? Was I high? No. Not high. Confirmed. I think I'd remember if I was. I think I just had a really slow day and haven't really been able to do much. Get much talking in. Get much funny out of my system. I think it's just all coming out right here, right now for you guys. Right here in the mic, dude. Just spitting. Spitting the lols, dude. Just spitting the lols. <laughs> Can that be a new saying for, like, the, the channel? I'm gonna start saying that on the Twitch stream. So that's gonna be that's gonna be me, dude. I'm gonna be the guy that started saying spitting the lulls. That's gonna be me. You're gonna you're gonna be able to hear that coming out of some famous YouTuber's mouth in the next few months, and then you're gonna realize, hey, Ace Turner Ninja was the first one to say spitting the lulls. Get on my level, scrubs. Also, we have things to sell. Let's sell the things. Let's do the things. Sell the thing. Let's buy all the balls we can. By the way. I'm gonna go ahead and just gonna buy two Pokeballs. Just two more Pokeballs. Making an even 20. We'll buy some great balls, because these are always useful. Always useful, confirmed. Uh, Ultra Balls are also always useful. Always useful, confirmed. I'm gonna buy an escape rope or two if we don't have one, just in case we get locked up in a weird situation and we don't have any other way out. We're gonna go for some max repels, just in case. Again, real weird situation. Way out. Uh, and let's go ahead and sell these items that we don't need. I think there was a bone or something. If I recall correctly, there was a bone or something. Um, rare bone. There it is. We can also sell the tiny mushroom, but not for that much yet. Hmm. Well, I guess that's all we had. Oh well. I do kind of want to check out the TMs and stuff here. Since we're here. Bean beans were here. I want to check out the TMs and such. Oh, a counter for my Poketch. Sure, I'll take a free thing. Why not? Why not? Oh, that's not what I wanted. No! Go away. Go away. Go away, you. These are X items, aren't they? Yep. Go away, you. Second most useless NPC in the game. I don't need your recommendations. I know what I'm doing, lady. I know how to shop the shop and walk the walk. How? What are you? Going to, what you got? Uh. I think we'll just buy one for now. Just buy one of everything because they're randomized, and I don't think I have any way of knowing what these are without buying them. Okay, wait, which one does which ones did we buy? We 38, 25, and 14. Let's see if these were worth spending money on. 28, 35, and 14. 38, 25. No. Yeah, 38, 25, and 14. We got Metal Claw, Mist Ball, and Ice Punch. Not not bad. Not bad. Metal Claw could be particularly useful if we can give it to if we can give it to Great Wall. That's a stab move, dude. I'll take it. I will take it. I will run with it. We'll forget taunt. Literally, probably never. Literally, probably. Yeah, that that con that that contradicted itself a little bit. Don't worry about it. Probably never gonna hit that move ever. Never gonna touch that move. Wait, we're learning miss ball right now. No, 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 no. no. We'll hold on to that for a second. Type later on. Ice punch has potential, but none of these guys do I want that to have. What? 
<laughs> what? That didn't, that didn't really make sense. Oh, we can buy one of these. Okay, 83. We just bought 83. I'll we'll have to remember to come back here and get TMs. 83, smoke screen. Awesome. Okay, just spent my last $2,000 on smoke screen. Yeah, we're not even gonna stay in here. We're gonna skedaddle out of here. We're gonna go back and uh, we're gonna we're gonna head on out of here and go and get that quick save going on and uh, wrap up the episode I think because we're running up on the 13 minute or 30 minute mark pretty quickly. In fact, we passed it about 45 seconds ago. So, hmm. oh well. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, which I really hope that you did, because I know that I did. I had a lot of fun recording it. And I hope you guys have a fun time watching it. So. If you enjoyed, make sure you drop a like for me down below. It really does help. Really, really. It, trust me. Trust me. You have no idea. It helps out a lot, dude. I have, I have a very small... I have, I have a very small ego. Okay, my, my personal... My, my, I can't words. What, is my, what am I looking for? Whatever. You, you know what? I ruined the joke. We're going to move on. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you did, make sure you drop a like for me down below. It really does help out a lot. Subscribe if you are new around here and share this video with a friend and I mean that hopefully you guys have a fantastic day and I'll see you guys all in the next video peace peace guys bye later